Get on the flavor train. Get on the flavor train. Get on the flavor, the flavor, the flavor train. Get on the flavor train with your girl, Lady T. Yeah. What's up, everybody? It's your girl, Tanya Lady T. And yes, you have stepped by. Did you hear me say step, step by? by? We ain't editing. Because y'all can step on the train, y'all can stop on the train, and y'all can get on the train. <laughs> anyway, I'm at Mama's house, of course, and um, she just prepared some little knick-knack patty wax while she's cooking uh, dinner. And the reason why I want to come on and go ahead on and upload this quick video is so y'all can, again, go to her channel, come on in. She has finally made the famous, infamous... Peggy's broccoli salad everybody's been asking about so that video is up and running I'm gonna leave her channel link in the description box so y'all go ahead on over there and do what it do and look y'all I read the community guidelines she needs 10,000 views so what you waiting on come on and go on and share come on in so she can go ahead on and get that 10,000 views so we can go ahead on and do what we need to do over here on the flavor train and at mama's house so anyway, just wanted to show y'all real quick and do a quick shout out for that. Be stay tuned for her. She's going to do another video on what actually is for dinner. So anyway, this is how we do. We've got avocado. We've got olives, sliced cheddar cheese, sharp cheddar cheese, and some sliced uh, tomatoes with Italian dressing on there. And this is just a little snacky, snacky snack. And some homemade salsa. I'll preview that. And she said she'll preview that on her channel one day. And some just crackers. And I've got a glass of sangria. And uh, I like my stuff extra cold. Y'all already know. Yes. So uh, this is what we're doing. So anyway, I know we can talk about something real quick, right quick, while we're gonna make this video at least got some crunches and some flavor and some tastiness going on let me go on and fix my plate so she can get to hers but I, I specifically saved this to talk because I'm, I'm just curious do other people in other parts of the world have flim flam people like this that live in their uh neighborhood or community now y'all y'all let, let me go let me let me just you know get the presentation going let me just get the food going right quick y'all chill but again uh ma you want to shout out and let everybody know thank you for your support and all that good stuff absolutely hey everybody you see me in the background i'm running around still trying to finish up sunday dinner we just having a little light hors d'oeuvre snack right now but thank you so much to everyone that subscribed to my channel, everybody that viewed my channel. Thank you for all the beautiful, wonderful, heartwarming comments that you gave me. And as promised, at least once a week, I'm going to get something on there so we can spend some time together. So thanks. I love you and God's peace. Okay. Here you go, Mom. Okay. I like this angle, but you know, this is the chair that my mom normally sits in at the head of the table, so she's letting me get away with it one time. One time. One time. Uh, uh, I was going, you know what I was thinking about? One uh, time, your girl. Uh, what's her name? What's her name? Yeah. Uh, that's her name. Lauren Hill. Lauren yeah. Hill. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can't think of it. Um, okay, now, this is on the serious tip in our community there's a lady that has a flower shop we're gonna uh, conceal the names to protect the anyway if there are any innocents. now get this and I'm thinking now what kind of kind of fragile rock mess is this my boss was telling me that there's this lady that's got this this uh, floor shop and I'll tell you what the name of it is off camera. But get this now. Yeah. But they moved to. No, 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 no not, not them. them. Uh-uh. Okay. Now, 
I ain't never know nobody did something like this. Anyway, let me go and cut to the chase. This. Amen. Amen. This jack leg woman is going goes into people's yards. And, yeah, she wait, 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 she goes no. into other people's lands, pretty folks with pretty landscape gardens with all the beautiful different flowers and stuff. She goes into their uh, their yard and she cuts their flowers no. to put in people. Yes, she got no. Bust. Wait, wait, wait. She got busted. Somebody busted her mm -hmm. taking pictures. She had been doing it for years, but you know it's like one of those things where she said, "Oh no, I was just walking my dog," and because I'm such a floral person at heart. I just go into when I see dead uh hydrangeas and stuff, it just it just bothers me. So I go in there and I cut them out. Liar, liar. You're a liar. And 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 and, and 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 what it is, she was using other people's floor flower arrangements in their homes. Can you believe that? Low down as it was, I can say creative. But see, that, man, I when she told me you that, be no, it's really the truth. So they're trying to spread the word to, to get this woman shut down because I wish I would catch I her wish I would in my yard. Her. My flowers that I went down to Lowe's and paid for and planted with my bad back and my bad knee, cut, put a pair of scissors to uh, one of my flowers mm. and. They would be then calling you scissor hands because them hands would be gone. Right, you be on air with scissor hand part two. Yes, I wish I would. Oh, um, people are so brazen. Open it. I mean, open it. That takes nerve to go or something. Yeah, suppose somebody blow your brains out. Look, I thought it was bad enough when y'all were growing up, little kids. You know how little kids go pull other people's little flowers and dandelion and come in and bring them. Mama, I brought you some flowers. I thought that was bad enough the way I used to get after y'all. Do not go in anybody's yard messing with their flowers. Now, a grown woman not only stole the flowers, but she sold the flowers. She stole the flowers? Help her, y'all. Then sold the flowers. She Help stole her. the flowers? Then, she then sold the flowers. flowers. Y'all help her. That's a sad state of affairs. That is so sad. And I wonder if she's going to get prosecuted. Or did it go that far? They don't know. They're just trying to get the word out. that this woman, you could be, you could be uh, buying. Your own flowers. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I never thought about it. <laughs> you could be buying your own flowers. You you trying to send your friend girl, her, her, you know she she she's down and out. She's not feeling well, or she got a she got a good job or got a promotion. She got married. You gonna send some flowers? And come to find out, she mm. got she got you sent her a flower from all y'all. <laughs> mm. Oh my goodness! I tell you, it takes all kinds of people. But how how the nerve? That you would do it blatantly and openly where people could see. They actually have pictures showing this woman. And they put her on Facebook. <laughs> Good. She got caught and they busted her wide open in the open. And so the thing that's, of this, That's, you know, even though we laugh and joke about it, that's that's a very, that's saddening. It, it, that is. It and what, my, what in your psyche make you think that that was okay to do? That that bothers. It, it Order your flowers heart. from, uh, you know, from that business. Or from those type of businesses yeah. that have flowers for your business. Don't I mean? Come on now. That's just like going in with a gun, sticking up a bank because you didn't have enough money. That's crazy. Yeah. Oh my God, this is so good. Mm mm. Mm mm. I said to my, when she told me my whole mouth just stayed open for about five minutes. It was so dry I had to get a drink of water. <laughs> I, I can't even understand. It's amazing the things that people would do in this world. It is very amazing. And sad, it's even sadder, she didn't have to do that because cut flowers, if that's what you do, it's not that hard to do in mm -hmm. this time of the year. You can get a pack of flower seeds and plant them 
And I guarantee you, in about eight weeks, those flowers are up and blooming. You go out there and really cut them. Mm. And they say you can't even, um, you know, when you're riding around on the highway and you see mm. the field of flowers. I don't think some people get caught. And get yeah, because that's that's city cutting, or state or cutting the flower. Flowers. Yeah, you you think about it. Those flowers were planted by either by city workers, and they're planted to beautify the city. So when you go out there and start cutting, you're stealing from the city. So yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That that's that's tragic. That is tragic. But I've seen people out there taking pictures in the field. Mm -hmm. They'll jump out the car real quick and. Oh yeah, cause remember when we were in Florida, we used to do the the cattails and all that kind of stuff. But um, yeah, I, I was just out done. I really was. When she told me that. Well, hopefully she learned a lesson from that and won't do it again. Cause I dare say, mm. she could she could potentially go to jail. Cause the, whoever's flowers those are, I'm sure they could press charges against. Everybody them. on sale block B, all the women on sale block B, all the women on sale block B, holla, 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 girl, what you in here for? What happened? <laughs> well. I knocked my boyfriend in the head with a radio clock and he lost his eye. Another woman say, well, I stole, well, federal crimes ain't gonna be in there, but you know what I mean. What you do, what you do? Was out cutting flowers out of people, y'all. And you could almost see it if she was like, saw some pretty flowers and just couldn't resist. Cut, I'm gonna grab me a couple of those flowers, but to cut them, to resell in your business? For resale? So. Yeah, I don't really think so. See, see that's the, that's the, that's the flim flam part about her. She did it for profit. She did it for profit. Yeah. Bad woman, bad woman. It's just like, um, that, that's almost like, in, it's just such a, you know, you're a fraud. That's mm -hmm. just like, you know, I happen to be watching these women who snap. They, they, there's a show called Snap. I'm sure you're probably mm -hmm. familiar with it. Oh, yeah. And you're in a relationship with a joker. And you're trying to help this joker out. You you know, because you figure, you know, he might not always be where you are financially. Mm -hmm. But, but he, he, you know, he seemed to be a good man. He working, he working. And he gets up every day and put on scrubs to go to work. Oh, my God. I saw that. Oh, did you see that episode? And that joker, she was dropping that joker off. And he was walking in there. Oh, my God. <laughs> Can you believe that? She was kissing. Bye, honey. Bye, Have honey. Good. Have a great day. Ooh. And he won't bit more employed than that squirrel out there chasing that nut. <laughs> <laughs> Can you believe that? That's a shame. Oh, it's just that it's in that arena, that 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 fraudulent arena. But could you even imagine being in that situation? Where oh, you find out not 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 only did he pretend he had a job, he pretend he had a professional, professional. highly skilled mm -hmm. job, bringing in all this money. Well, I, I can't remember how he got past the part where he wasn't bringing the money. What was he robbing somebody? What I don't know. He had to be robbed because I mean if I'm dropping you off that many times a day in the morning to go to work and I don't never see no check. Oh, 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 oh the light bill dude, the water bill dude, the baby needs some milk. I think he was doing so I can't remember what but I remember that little scenario where she was dropping him off and she was just skinning and grinning and bragging about the fact that she had her a doctor. doctor. Uh, yeah, had her a doctor. He was a, not only was he a doctor, he was an emergency, emergency room, room doctor. doctor. <laughs> <laughs> uh-uh, oh, honey. Jesus. That's the, but again, that's, it's in that same project. Mm -hmm. Oh, what about that joke was on the news not too long ago? Well, this joker was in, he had set up a practice or something working in doc, and he was actually 
uh, uh, taking in patience. Wait, wait, taking it, and that joker didn't have not the first credential to take your temperature. Mm -hmm. He didn't have the first credential to stick a Q-tip in your ear. <laughs> <laughs> and that joker Girl. had went in and seen people, had uh, subscribed medicine. Mm -hmm. That was just one of those things where his mess fell through the crack yeah. until somebody just said, start looking mm -hmm. side, real side out at him. They said, wait, 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 something ain't right. You mean to tell me, oh, you you going, you mean to tell me I got to have my whole leg amputated because I got a mosquito bite? Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Something's wrong with that diagnosis. Ooh. Yes. Girl. Ooh. Y'all. It takes all, it takes all kinds, y'all. That's a crazy fuck in this world. Mmm. I don't have to do it for a change, though. Y'all, y'all need to try it. Get you a piece of cracker, a piece of cheese, some avocado, a tomato. Let me get me another olive. Get you a tomato and put it on this bad boy like this right here. Anyway, y'all, I didn't want to make this a long video other than just stop in. Say, hey, what's up? Y'all show my mama some love. And go on over there to her channel. And um, we'll see you on the next video. Will it be today or will it be next week? Just keep watching. Thanks again, guys. Peace out. All right. And thanks for stopping here on the flavor train because what? What? Flavor is where it's at. <laughs>